Okay, so um, I've had a lot of people reach out to me. I'm aware that three service members just lost their lives in Jordan and 25 more were wounded. Of course, my thoughts and prayers go out to those, those soldiers and their family members. So the big question that everyone wants to know is what do I think the response is going to be from the U.S.? Now, I want to you know, advise everybody that the U.S. historically um, de-escalates things before we escalate things. So same thing in the Red Sea. We were saying, hey, stop shooting at these ships. We shot down all their missiles, and then they continued, so we responded. An unprovoked attack against service members that ended in loss of human life is, of course, a serious escalation by our enemies. But I, for one, frankly, am not convinced that the powers that be uh, will be willing or have the stomach to do what sh I feel should be done. Now, you may ask, HLC, what do you think should be done? Well, I think that at this point, we can no longer avoid the potential for a larger uh, conflict in the region. That being said, I think we should absolutely avoid putting boots on the ground because putting more human lives in danger is never a good idea. We possess the most airborne, uh, seaborne, and launchable fires in the world. And I think the response should be decisive. I think it should be excessively violent. And I think that it should send a message uh, and return that pain tenfold to our enemy. But that's my opinion. Again, this is my own individual opinion and not the opinion of any government entity.